Ah, us need a babe, please. Acha nae. Us need a babe. Don't dare. Don't dare. Disturb my peace to that level. Tunaenda wapi na wewe? Everything I want right now ni uniambie penye mmetoana na King David na all that you have been doing penye mmepeleka pesa zangu. Wewe. 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 Ah, no, no, do, do. You and Catherine. Yes. Uh there are something uh that is going on anything are you are you does it mean that you guys are uh, into something you told me that you're not married yes i'm not married are you dating catherine in any means uh now that's a personal question I that the lady the person is still relying on the on the lady mm -hmm. to assist in some mm -hmm. stuff mm -hmm. so when i spoke to catherine last time mm -hmm. and she told me about the ex husband mm -hmm. who also had some conditions that she does not know about she mm -hmm. did not even tell me about conditions i do, you know it's it's so weird that i'm finding out about the name of the ex love that you show me yes that i cannot take it for granted love that you show me i cannot deny Hello guys, uh, what's up, what's up, what's up, everybody, this is uh, Director Samaritan 254, now how are to help any Eastern TV guys, before we start, again, make sure that you subscribe, you comment, and also share his videos of Fikia, as many people as uh, possible, guys, we told you that uh, uh, every time, we'll try our level best to be introducing to you new guests, and uh, today, I'm um, having a guest, I'm by and he uh, Sifazake San. I've heard his, uh, uh, I've heard him uh, uh, from different people discussing on how he's a good entrepreneur. And I thought it's good for us to invite him here in our studio so that he may tell us who he is. And uh, at least, kuna watu wengi sana ambao kwa kule inje, wana tutazama na wako. Na watoto pengine wangependa kusomeshewa watoto, wengi wao wanaitaji some sponsorship. And I thought, uh, it's good for us to have him so that he may give us, uh, show us the way. Na hizi kutonesha njia gani, wale watu ambao wana scholarship, wale watu ambao hawana sponsors, wakweza kuwasomesha. Njia ambao naiza tumia ndiweza kumfikia. Sijui ni ye ama kona watu ambao wana msaidia. Karibu sana King David. Mm, thank you. First of all, who's uh, King David? K King David, I mean. Uh, it's funny that you call me by the title King David. <laughs> My name is Driver. Uh -huh. So I'm David, mm -hmm. but people gave me the title King mm -hmm. based on the way I mm help -hmm. people outside. Mm -hmm. So I'm just a simple guy, mm -hmm. an entrepreneur, mm -hmm. uh, both locally and internationally, mm -hmm. but I so much venture into NGOs, mm -hmm. foundations, something that is going to focus on helping people mm -hmm. from below, mm -hmm. that's what I do. Uh, we, we heard your, uh, you being mentioned from different, uh, uh, from different people mm -hmm. and we thought it's good to invite you here so that you may tell us maybe uh, the people that you, uh, you deal with mostly. Uh, what do you deal with apart from the NGOs? What do you deal specifically with? I'm a business person, mm -hmm. as I said earlier. Mm -hmm. So let me say that I'm an investor also. Okay. So when I say that I'm a business and an entrepreneur both locally and internationally, mm -hmm. I'm also an investor. Mm -hmm. And I like investing in stocks and also shares from other countries mm -hmm. also. Mm -hmm. So I venture most so in the country, I venture with NGOs dealing with charity work mm -hmm. that's helping out children mm -hmm. who cannot help themselves, mm -hmm. uh, widows, mm -hmm. and I think there's one organization that I deal with mm -hmm. here in the country mm -hmm. that also help people, mm -hmm. the ones that are sick. Mm -hmm. So it will fund them, mm -hmm. take them for um, me medical mm -hmm. trips, mm -hmm. and then people come back when they're okay. Mm -hmm. They don't pay anything. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So you're the one who takes care of everything so in terms of payments? I, I, you know, this mm -hmm. traveling, mm -hmm. I've also been able to get some connections. Mm -hmm. So the connection, the few connections that I got abroad mm -hmm. in the country that I go to, mm -hmm. they help me take care of others. Mm -hmm. so, you know, it's so weird that you're going to ask for payment from somebody to mm -hmm. assist them mm -hmm. while you're getting that assistance for mm -hmm. free. Mm -hmm. So what I do is that I react like a link mm -hmm. between 
two people now. Mm -hmm. The one to have fund mm -hmm. and the one that needs the funding. I, I told you about Eastern TV and to, you told me that you've never heard of us. That no, means that we... No, 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 no. Uh, what do you watch? Mostly on YouTube? Uh, Let me ask. Mostly on YouTube. When I, when I go to YouTube, mm -hmm. maybe I've been referred by somebody. Mm -hmm. But I don't spend my time on YouTube. Mm -hmm. I won't lie on that. Mm -hmm. I don't spend my time on social media. Mm -hmm. I'm mostly working. I'm a workaholic also mm -hmm. in a way. So mm -hmm. I don't have time for social media. So that means that um, uh, you're not a fan of YouTube. Even music you don't watch, maybe. Are you a uh, fan of uh, <laughs> you know, some uh, local musicians, maybe, or international? I, I, I listen to songs, mm -hmm. but it, it, it depends on the mood of the situation also, mm -hmm. you know. Mm -hmm. uh, there's a time that you just want to chill mm -hmm. and there's a time that you don't want anything because mm -hmm. you need to think about your next move, mm -hmm. you need to think about your next business or mm -hmm. your next trip mm -hmm. and most of the time uh, when I'm around I don't get time to just relax. Mm -hmm. uh, if you find me listening to music not unless I'm going to chill out with my friends, mm -hmm. maybe you're going somewhere and chilling mm -hmm. just for some few minutes then boom. Uh, the reason of why I called you here, mm. I've heard your your name being mentioned in okay. uh, an NGO that I'm so familiar with, an organization mm. uh, that is called Soulful Heart. Oh, yeah. How well do you know Soulful Heart and how you connected with them? Soulful Heart. Mm -hmm. When I was speaking about the organization that help children mm -hmm. and also sick people mm -hmm. get help from the other kind, mm -hmm. I was talking about Soulful Heart. Mm -hmm. It's the organization that I work with in Kenya mm -hmm. that is so much charitable to children mm -hmm. and women mm -hmm. and also people that are not well uh, health-wise. Mm -hmm. So, for instance, let's say, how, how, how I know they operate. Mm -hmm. uh, for instance, if somebody is sick but they, can, they cannot raise mm -hmm. funds to mm -hmm. go abroad for treatment, mm -hmm. that's where we come in. Mm -hmm. So the connection, because I've got people that are so much willing to help mm -hmm. people that are sick. This mm -hmm. is health that we're talking about. Mm -hmm. So Soulful Heart mm -hmm. gets me people mm -hmm. that are, you know, I collaborate so much hand to hand with the management. Mm -hmm. They get to tell me the people, this, this, and this, and this, and this person has mm -hmm. got this problem, this mm -hmm. one has got this problem. Mm -hmm. So can you assist us? If it's something that is so much serious, what mm -hmm. we do is that we find a way mm -hmm. to help these people. Mm -hmm get the help that they need. Mm -hmm. So after that, it's a deal that we make with the, mm -hmm. with the Soulful Foundation, mm -hmm. Soulful Hearts. Mm -hmm. And over the time that I, over the period of time that I've been working with them, mm -hmm. I can only say that it's been positive results. Uh, okay, uh, mm -hmm. th that uh, takes us to a very uh, personal question. Eh? Okay. You and uh, Soulful Hearts Management, that is the mm -hmm. CEO, mm -hmm. Madam Catherine, how well are you connected, you two? How well you, are you connected? Madam Catherine. Yeah, them. yeah. Kate. We call her Kate. You call her Kate. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. Uh, Why do you seem to be so hesitant? No, you're asking how I'm connected. Though. Yeah, so are I'm, you I'm, in a relationship with her? Are you married, first of all? No, 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 mm -hmm. no, no, not exactly. Mm -hmm. And Madam Who is she to you then? Madam Kate and I, we've been working together. Mm -hmm. She runs the organization. Mm -hmm. And as I told you, mm -hmm. we partner with the organization. Mm -hmm. So if she runs the organization mm -hmm. and we partner with the organization, mm -hmm. I meet her most of the time when mm -hmm. I'm around. Or sometimes we talk over the phone also. Mm -hmm. And that's how I get to get about the people that need different kind of assistance. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now, there are some messages that uh, are or some uh, something that you are trying to uh, dig and know as a media uh, TV, as a media uh, station. Mm. Uh, we came to realize we are doing some investigation about okay. a client that is called James. Okay. Are you aware or of uh, such a client? A client by yeah. the name James. Yeah. Or you are patient. I, can, I don't know whether I should refer him as no, a patient. No, 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 no. Mm -hmm. uh, that cannot be a client of mine, neither can that be a patient of mm -hmm. mine. Mm -hmm. And I've dealt with a lot of Mr. James. Mm -hmm. So I don't know the Mr. James that you're talking about because mm -hmm. I've dealt with a lot of Mr. James people. A person with a stomach James. condition who's supposed to be going outside the country oh, yeah. uh, for uh, some treatment, who's supposed to be raised for 4 million Kenya shillings. Are you aware with the, that kind of a case? Uh, I've got such kind of a case mm -hmm. which was brought 
to my attention by mm -hmm. Madam Catherine. Mm -hmm. And when I, was, when, I was talking to, when I was talking to her, mm -hmm. she told me that there's this guy that has got a condition mm -hmm. that we've been trying. Mm -hmm. We've been trying in the country, different hospitals that we have not been able to get any kind of assistance. Mm -hmm. So she asked me if there's a way that my organization mm -hmm. could help mm -hmm. fund this person to mm -hmm. get assistance the way we also help with the others. Mm -hmm. but. I never ask. Uh, I never ask about who is that person. Mm -hmm. What does that person do? Mm -hmm. Why does this person need this and this? Mm -hmm. Of course, there are some details that I'll have to ask. Mm -hmm. What does this person? Uh, what makes this person need my mm -hmm. help so much? Mm -hmm. Why can't this person fund their own uh, mm -hmm. medical uh, medical journey? Mm -hmm. So I was intro. I was introduced by uh, to a guy. Mm -hmm. I haven't met him. Mm -hmm. But I think that's the Mr. James you're talking about, mm -hmm. and he has got a condition. Mm -hmm. And I, we, we've been talking with uh, Madam Catherine for some time, mm -hmm. finding ways that we can help, mm -hmm. because the condition that this guy has, it's a critical condition. Mm -hmm. I won't lie to you. Mm -hmm. I won't lie to you. Mm -hmm. But about me getting so much connected with my, the people that I'm helping, mm -hmm. no, I only get to help through Madam Catherine. Mm -hmm. So I don't get to meet them directly. You and Catherine? Yes. Uh, there are something uh, that is going on. Anything? Are you? Are you? Does it mean that you guys are uh, into something? You told me that you're not married. Yes, I'm not married. Are you dating Catherine in any means? Uh, no, that's a personal question. I just asked because are you aware that Catherine is married? No, not exactly. But I'm aware that Catherine is divorced. Is divorced. That yes. was. Well, that's what you know. Yes. Right now. Yeah. She's there not, is a case. She's not married. Uh, there is a case, and uh, soon it will be taken by the court. Okay. Uh, court of law. Soon you'll be, the organization shall be sued. And you, that's how I got your contact. I got your contact from uh, uh, people. This is a case that also involves my organization. Yeah, because mm. you were seen uh, talking with uh, Madam Catherine mm. uh, about the 300,000 Kenya shillings that was sent to you. Mm. And instead of using it for treatment, you're using it to uh, build a house in Malaysia. Is that a false or a, a true statement, according to uh, you? Um, remind me your name. Samaritan is my Samaritan. name. Samaritan. Yes. Now, Samaritan, it's a good question that you get. To, uh, <laughs> you brought this up. It's mm -hmm. about money. Mm -hmm. 300,000 mm -hmm. that was sent to me mm -hmm. that is building something mm -hmm. in another country. Mm -hmm. And let's be realistic. Mm -hmm. What can 300,000 do? Can it build a house even in this country? I, do you have a house in Malaysia? Yes, personally I've got Okay, a wait, wait. You have a house in Malaysia, right? Yes. Uh, am I an angel to know that you, are, you have a house in Malaysia? No. Mm -hmm. That's why I had to ask. I also had to answer you mm -hmm. well because... How, how did I know that you have a house in Malaysia then? I must, been, I must have been given information. Over how there. much is that house in Malaysia? My house. Mm -hmm. I prefer not to say that because mm -hmm. that's my property. That's something I don't think it's. Whose house is that? Is that yours or is it yours or it's yours with the, uh, Madam Catherine? No, 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 no. Mm -hmm. I've got my own place. Mm -hmm. I've got my own place. And so <clears throat> when, uh, when I met with Madam Catherine, when, mm -hmm. when this was speaking last time, mm -hmm. I told her that because I travel a lot, mm -hmm. I'd also like to introduce you to the people, bro. Mm -hmm. And because these are open, where I live, where the place that I've got a place, mm -hmm. is a place that is open, mm -hmm. whereby any person, you can also come and own a property in this mm -hmm. place, it's not a problem. Mm -hmm. So I told her that, why don't you, it's good, mm -hmm. not just to rely on one side. Mm -hmm. You can have as many properties as you want. Mm -hmm. So I got an opportunity, she told me that if you get an opportunity that mm -hmm. I can also be a land owner mm -hmm. or a, an apartment owner in that place that you are in mm -hmm. or do you connect me with mm -hmm. and i was like ah that's a good idea because mm -hmm. now i'll be getting to work close to you mm -hmm. and plus another thing when you asked me about mm -hmm. whether she's married i never knew that mm -hmm. Mad madam kate and i apart from business mm -hmm. uh we started a relationship that's mm -hmm. After some time, and mm -hmm. I was like, she's a single lady, mm -hmm. she's divorced, and I'm a, I'm a single man. Mm -hmm. There's no problem with us being in a relationship. Mm -hmm. As long as it does not interfere with our businesses, mm -hmm. then we're good. Mm -hmm. And so we've been communicating, mm -hmm. but when it comes to the project about a house that is being purchased in another area, mm -hmm. 
300,000 is not enough to purchase a house. Okay, let me ask you. Yes. Are you saying that 300,000 cannot purchase a house in no. Malaysia no, 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 no. or in at any other place, even in Kenya, you can't purchase a house no, with 300,000. Basically, 3,000. Let me ask you, yeah. you and Madam Catherine, yes. you were seen. Messages were, we read some messages okay. in her phone. Mm -hmm. You calling mm -hmm. Mr. James, who's a person who's, who, being the person who's suffering, mm -hmm. who's, who's having a certain condition, mm -hmm. you are seen calling him a fossil. What is the meaning of that statement? You okay, calling okay, someone fossil? Okay, okay. Does it mean that you are so inhuman? No, no, no. You no, don't no. even value a life of someone. You Be calling someone a fossil. Okay, what is the meaning of that word fossil? According to you, okay. uh, calling yourself a person who helps, calling mm -hmm. a person, calling yourself a person who uh, gives uh, gives charity no. to children <clears throat> or people who are sick. Why call people fossil? Okay, it's good. You know. When when I when I when you're talking about fossil, I think that's a mess um, something that you saw in a message, text mm -hmm. message. Yeah, you and Catherine chatting. And yes, I did text that. Mm -hmm. But I was referring to the ex. Mm -hmm. Okay? As a fossil. <clears throat> this is an ex. Mm -hmm. This is someone that she, she is no longer in a relationship with the lady. Mm -hmm. But you find yourself in a way that the lady, the person is still relying on the on the lady mm -hmm. to assist in some mm -hmm. stuff. Mm -hmm. So when I spoke to Catherine last time, mm -hmm. and she told me about the ex-husband mm -hmm. who also had some conditions that she does not know about. She mm -hmm. did not even tell me about conditions. I do, I, you know, it's, it's so weird that I'm finding out about the name of the ex mm -hmm. to be Mr. James mm -hmm. that I have been also trying to help. Mm -hmm. Because I've also sent some money to Catherine mm -hmm. to assist. You see that? Mm -hmm. I've also sent money. Mm -hmm. You're talking about 300,000. Mm -hmm. I've sent to Catherine more than 1 million. Mm -hmm to assist with this person. Mm -hmm. So for me, I was not help, I was not uh, assisting in a way that I'm assisting a fossil, no. Mm -hmm. When I was talking about a fossil, mm -hmm. I was talking about, she told me about my ex-husband mm -hmm. has got this and this condition. Mm -hmm. So when she told me that my ex-husband has got a very uh, strong condition that I don't know, a delicate condition that I cannot explain, mm -hmm. I was like, okay. What condition is that? Does it bother you in any way? And mm -hmm. she was like, no, it doesn't bother me in any uh, way. Let me ask you something, sir. Yes, sir. I respect what you're doing, but at the moment, right now, you seem to be luring people money by involving the companies that were closed. Right now, is a direct line insurance company functioning? Let's be honest here. Direct line insurance mm -hmm. company. From mm -hmm. the last time I checked, mm -hmm. the company closed. Mm -hmm. I think it was suspended. So Does it mean that you are luring people money and then you are lying to them that the money was uh, uh, was invested at direct line company? Okay. You are someone that is so much focused with news and international news also. Mm -hmm. I've got an inter uh, my organization is by the name Ceci. Mm -hmm. And Ceci, there's not even a single day that I, it has ever been on the limelight mm -hmm. with corruption or laundering. Mm -hmm. So when you're talking about laundering and squandering people's money, mm -hmm. I don't think I'm anywhere connected with that. Mm -hmm. Another thing is that when you talk about direct line, my company does, is not mm -hmm. uh, insured by direct line insurance. Mm -hmm. And from the look of things, I mm -hmm. think it, has, it was suspended some time back. Mm -hmm. So if it's direct line connections to any company, mm -hmm. that should be companies mm -hmm. from local. Mm -hmm. But from my company, no. Mm -hmm. I don't uh, launder money from mm -hmm. my company. Mm -hmm. and all the transactions that happen in my company are always put mm -hmm. in limelight for each and every person. So you are not, you are never involved in no. any uh, luring of people money? You no, never... I don't do that. Mm -hmm. I don't do that. Mm -hmm. And if there's any person that will be saying that my organization has laundered their money in mm -hmm. any way or has snatched money from them, mm -hmm. let them come with the evidence, mm -hmm. put it on the table, mm -hmm. and if it's true, mm -hmm. They'll be refunded their money mm -hmm. because we don't do that. Mm -hmm. We don't do that. Let me tell you something. When you asked me about the three hundred thousand, mm -hmm. I told you that you're talking about three hundred thousand that came to me, mm -hmm. but I've spent more than three hundred thousand. Mm -hmm. You see, mm -hmm. you know, when I'm helping out, mm -hmm. I'm not helping because it's someone that I know. Mm -hmm. Me sending money to Madam Catherine to mm -hmm. also cut off for some few stuff that mm -hmm. she was telling me about the ex-husband. Mm -hmm. She told me that the ex-husband is no longer married. Mm -hmm. Have you ever seen him? No, 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 no. I haven't met him. Why would I meet my So you were girlfriend? just calling someone by well, the name Possil? You know, according to the story, you know, we speak mm -hmm. as a couple. Mm -hmm. And sometimes you are 
woman will tell you the bad things that has been done with the other person mm-hmm. and as a man you'll be like no 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 I cannot take this from a fellow man mm-hmm. so that person does not even deserve to be called a man you mm-hmm. see that mm-hmm. so i think that's where the name fossil came mm-hmm. from mm-hmm. and from it's, uh, people understand history mm-hmm. fossil is uh, the dead cells you see that yeah. the former cells so mm-hmm. That's why it falls in, but I have. We, we do this, eh? Yes. We do this, eh? Mm. I understand that you're uh, an investor. Yes. You're a person who's doing business. Yes. Uh, you know, investor, mm. businessman, mm. all those names, yes, big yes. names, mm. and you have a name to keep. Yes. But I would like us to put everything on the table. Okay. You face your fears. Yes. Exactly. And your fears is mm. uh, right now. Uh, I have a guest that I want to introduce to you, a person who I called in the studio so that you may have a conversation and we at least you put everything black and white okay. on the table okay. and you get to know director bring for me the bring bring bring, bring our guest kindly love that you show me yes that i cannot take it for granted love that you show 